Oh, Nostalgia, you are such a cruel mistress. Hey everyone, Spaz2K here, and we're now in a secret dungeon that was part of, that was a new add-on. Yeah, we'll go with that. It was an add-on to DX, it wasn't in the original, so first thing you're going to want to do is distinguish between the colors of these guys. Do that, and path is open. Now, for those who can actually hear it, never mind. I was going to say, for those who could actually hear it, the music in this dungeon is... dungeon theme from the very first Zelda game, so, yeah. Okay, anyway, do all this, get the compass, and a little secret right here, for those who are short on cash. Place a bomb. And in here, I'm not entirely sure how many, uh, rupees there are, I'll go through and count them later, but, yeah, you get quite a, quite a few, uh, quite a few of them. I don't know if they regenerate or not, I haven't ever checked actually. <laughs> it's always funny. Okay, for this you gotta throw the right guy in the right color hole. Interpret that how you will. We got the pecker! Okay, this dungeon drill is not that hard. Then they get another key. Go this way. Kill these guys. It's not really mandatory, but... Oh yeah, it is. If you want to get back out. Okay. Mini boss. And... <laughs> I, you gotta love it when the enemy tells you something isn't effective against them. Do, it, do something else. What you want to do here is sprinkle the powder on him. Try to die in the process. Okay, once he's dead, pick up the fairy. Go here, and I believe this is the nightmare key, so. I think this is one of my favorite dungeons. It's short, it's simple, there's not a whole lot that can go wrong in here. So, that and the music is pretty kick ass. As you can hear in the background. Kill these Christmas motherfuckers. sound. Okay, so now we use the key to go through this door. And probably one of the most annoying bosses ever, because no matter how good you are, you will get injured. Because even if you jump in the air and he hits the ground, you yeah, exactly like that. You it will always stop you in your tracks, so if you're trying to do a spin attack or something like that, it, it, it doesn't work, so... I hate this little fucking guy. I don't die in the process. God damn it. Just fucking die already. Time you're ready. There we go. Grab the get back here. Grab the ferry. Go this way. <laughs> Come the pot. 
step on that. An interesting thing when you have a pod or something like that, those little bouncy platforms don't affect you, so. Just get some pod to walk right across. This right here is really actually simple. When I first played this, I, I think it took me like 15 minutes to figure that one out. I was just screwing around one day and, you know, I'm like, well, what if you just hit all of them around the side? So, anyway. We go. Trying to find a fairy. Because this last boss could be a pain in the ass. So, anyway, go through this door and. Okay, now that I've done that, I had to go to the third dungeon to find a crystal, so anyway, once you do that, here's the final boss for the dungeon, so... Give me a little clue about the color, so pretty much you gotta keep hitting them until the blue turns to red. Bitch because he keeps knocking it backwards. Quite a bit. So, best thing to do is to get between him and the wall. Take your time. I always like that. He doesn't want to die. He'll tell you how to kill him, but he doesn't want to die, so you can take your time. Well, if you don't get a heart piece, what you get is probably one of the most useful things in the game. I'm shaking the microphone like a fucking sword. I mean this, th this should be a no-brainer, they should, the red is always going to be the best one, the only downside is, yeah I'm sure, the only downside is, all the power-ups you find are those goddamn acorns, and you know how much I love those, anyway, now that you got the, now you pick your choice between red tunic and blue tunic, blue one ups your defense, red one ups your power, which, I don't, I don't see why anyone would not want this. Unless they just suck and keep getting killed. Then the blue ones might be your choice. Anyway, I'm going on too long. Go this way, don't grab the wall, grab the rock. Going this way. Now we are actually on our way to the third dungeon, so. I was already in there, so I'll probably go through and pose and just place the uh, part where I went through there first at the beginning of the next video, so. Might dub over that. Anyway, here's the third video, and next time, we'll actually go inside. Bye!